from the Malawian community. The committee, Amake committee, Friends of Malawi, be it from uh, Zimaza and other countries here represented. I will repeat, I'm extremely, extremely delighted to be here. It's a moment that brings mixed feelings, as you may know. Mixed feelings in this that on one part, I could say that I had just started uh, uh, networking with the correct people, the right people, uh, to bring a difference between the bilateral relations uh, Malawi and Kenya and beyond. What you and me may plan may not necessarily be that which God has planned for you. So when moments like these come, and uh, this in my short life has not been the first time, you are sad, definitely, to leave friends and uh, colleagues, people who were by my side, uh, assisting and working with me, people, especially that's why I mentioned the elders from the Malawi community who were there for me, advising me. And for you who are not familiar with the Malawian tradition, is that you may be holding a position, but honor and glory is first and foremost given to those who are elders or older than you, because in most cases, if not in all cases, they know more than you. So I, I, I really appreciate uh, your support uh, in everything during the one year we've been here. The timing of my living should not surprise you. Should not surprise you because when I was living in Malawi, I signed a three year contract. And uh, the three years, two years in India, and one year here, three years, that's the end of my contract. It's the prerogative of the appointing officer who happens to be the president of the Republic of Malawi to either renew your contract or not. In my case, uh, I tried to probe a bit uh, why, why, maybe, uh, you can tell me, sir, President, uh, why do you want me back in Malawi? And all that, he kept insisting, come back here. Come back here. And uh, when you are in a position where uh, your main goal as a public servant is to help your country you would not say no to such a thing it's very interesting that we received within my family this information with uh, a lot of acceptance without necessarily knowing what is in store for us when we go back. Uh, in other words, we, we could have chosen to be very worried, oh, why are they moving us uh, away from here and all that. Uh, it's been so special that the feeling 
hopes for ten things and uh, expectations uh, has, has really filled our hearts uh, waiting for our departure. Now, the, the Chairman Amake has uh, mentioned quite a few things that uh, we have achieved during the one year I've been here. Uh, I arrived here with my family on 3rd March last year. So, uh, and my contract uh, was ending in April. So they normally give you three months within which to prepare yourself uh, for exit. I was happy to be here for many reasons, being home, Africa, as opposed to where we were uh, in India, where many things were different, totally different. When you come to a lovely place like Nairobi, whose weather is not very different, or not different at all, uh, from uh, that of Malawi. You come here, you see the smiling faces of uh, Kenyans. You come here and you remember one of the first friends that our founding father, Kamuzu Banda, had was with the founding father of Kenya, Mzee Yomo Kenyatta. And uh, I can, I can, um, I keep saying this, but I will repeat. No other country in Africa has honored Mze Jomo Kenyatta more than Malawi has. This is because, apart from the statue of uh, Kamuzu Banda, which we have in Malawi, the only other statue of a president is that of Mze Jomo Kenyatta. We have a statue in Blanca. Now, the aim for the Malawi government to send us here was to see how we can enhance the bilateral relationships between our two countries. And I think we have done that maybe not 100% of what we could have achieved but we have gone a mile. You remember last year in July when um, the deputy president of Kenya visited Malawi during our republic celebrations? That was a very, very, very good sign of uh, our relationship enhanced. enhanced relationship between our two countries. And there are so many other things that have happened which I cannot mention here that show me that the future is bright for our relationship. 